All right, dudes and dudettes, what is up? We are back here on the Foolcraft 3 server from Graphonomical. I always say that differently every time. But anyway, we're gonna get cracking like and right into the video. Guys, look at this. I made I made some changes. I think it looks a lot freaking better. Um, I'll just go through the changes here. I guess I'm gonna have to Okay, we're good. So check it out. Ooh, that's loud. That's loud jetpack. Okay. So this is pretty much the same down here, but what I went ahead and did is I pointed the um the atomic reconstructure downward. Uh, just put a timer here. We're gonna put a block here, something like that. That way you can't see any of it. Uh, and then I put these up here. Uh, I used a lot of uh, item ducks instead this time. And we've also got these that we need to put some stuff on. I don't know yet. Uh, we might do that anyway. Uh, but check this out. Uh, we got uh, item ducks here and it's a basalt cover. So there is item ducks flowing around to all these. This is actually a bit slower than I'd like. I might upgrade this to the next tier up because it's just the normal. Uh, item ducks uh, and then it goes uh, into the inner chest here the canola comes up here and gets uh, pressed into canola oil then it comes up here into the fermenting barrels and gets or fermented and then it turns into the refined canola oil and then what we've got here is we've got a system so that these three fire at the same time so it'll go canola oil uh, or refined canola oil, then it'll go boom, crystallized canola seed, then it'll go boom and powered. We're running low on that, aren't we? We are. That's not good. Hmm. So, yeah, I was worried that would happen. The reason being this happened is we can just shut this off for a second. As this is pulling too quick, because I have to have this thing completely full so that the atomic assembler down here can make these because if this is pulling too fast it uh, it doesn't work very well it's not very nice can you just freaking thank you <laughs> so yeah we're gonna i'm gonna have to find a way around this i'll have to do that later uh, but today's episode, guys, we're finally going to get off of Lava Power, which is something I've wanted to do for a while because we've been just kind of wrecking the nether uh, with all the dirt and everything. So we're going to sync these up together, um, and it's going to be awesome. Now, the way I want to do it, I think it's going to be pretty cool. So we're going to use this empowered uh, canola oil, obviously. We've got 116 buckets, and now I would like to use these. So this is dead center here. So, hmm, that's not exactly how I planned that to go. Okay, let's try this again. So that's center there, so we'll place it like this, like this, like this, like this. And then over here, we go like this, like this, like this, and like this. Just like, actually, we'll go up two more. Why? Because I accidentally hit shift and made an entire stack. That's why. Perfection. And now when I log on, it won't be, uh, I won't have to go find new lava. Because every time I've logged on, uh, I've always had to come and find new lava sources. Stop charging the freaking thing, you stupid guy. Okay. Okay, so let's go. Do I have any more fluid? I don't think I have any more of that fluid, but we do have this fluid duct. Oh, we do have some more. Maybe Ender. I don't think we have enough. Being honest, we're gonna try it though. Oh, that's not helping. I was able to save a heck ton of these, um, so that's a good sign. Gosh dang it! Stop doing that. Thank you. Eight. Wow, we had enough. Are these getting filled up? Wait, you're not extracting yet. Now what else do they need? They need empowered oil and they need, I think that's water. So let's grab a sink. We should have a sink. We've got three. Let's take this sink, put it right here. <gasps> oh no, son of a biscuit. It's okay, it's okay, I found a way around. I think I found a way around. Yeah. 
And we extract two. Yep, this is producing power. Let's see how fast is it charging. Oh my gosh, we've already got 2.9 million RF. Holy crepes. Holy crepes. Holy crepes. How much how much of these are going? They're they're freaking all going. How are you still filled up? Wow. What oh boy, why have I done this? <laughs> Just oh jeez. Huh. It's going to be using this for a while. Hey, oh, it's gone. Oh, it's already gone. Hit hello, phone. Oh, there was someone went to live on Twitch. Holy crap, guys. That makes so much power. I want to figure out how much power that adds. Um, so let's get a power cell going. Huh. That didn't work. Power cell. Can we craft one of these up? Oh, we sure can. And that was the last one we could craft up. Rip. Okay. So this is the input. And we're going to link this one up to 25. Yep. Now, I plan on having one of these on each side. And then we're going to ramp up this eventually. But not, not quite yet. Not quite yet. We're just testing the waters. think I think I might have linked that wrong hold up hold up it needs to be the other one let's try because that one goes out to it at 21 Ampli thin 21. Oh, hello there. So how are you doing over here? Oh, I don't know. Let's uh, let's charge the that guy. We'll see how we're doing. Input. Oh my gosh. 10,000 RF per tick. That's how much we're making over here? Guys, we don't have to do lava power anymore. Oh my gosh. How are you doing? You're still climbing. Oh my gosh, guys, this is so freaking awesome. And it'll just keep running by itself. And we've hardly used any of the empowered stuff. Oh, yes. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to keep building up the sides here. And I. Oh, what the heck? How did you do that? That was weird. There we go. Anyways, I will see you guys in a bit. All right, so this is the look we're going for. Uh, I think it looks pretty good. I like the contrast between the sandstone and the basalt. Uh, but we're going to fill this in back here as well. Um, and I think I might want to do sandstone back here. Um, let's see. This is all we're going to be able to fill it in? Oh, come on. That's going to look really bad, isn't it? Uh, it looks okay. I only really like the, the look of that back there. But it's working freaking awesome, guys. Check this out. So... I'm going to let the uh, the stuff catch up, um, but we are making freaking freaking good power, that's for sure. Look at this thing, 10,000 RF per tick. It's freaking crazy. It's freaking crazy, dudes. All right, so I think we're going to start... Um, we're going to start building up the area over here. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? There it is. Sorry, it's always hard to find that one for some reason. Uh, so the corner, we go angle by two. Let's do it. Let's go one, two, and on the three. Is it just two? Oh, it is just two. All right. And this way, it's not a perfectly square room. And this is where we will start. Now, we're going to take this one, knock it out. I just thought of this. Knock it out. Oh, that's right, guys. That was class. Uh, anyway, we removed um, Twilight Forest. And we've changed that up a bit because of it. Um, yeah, it doesn't really work that much anymore. Uh, so, <laughs> kind of sad um, that all the blocks are gone. The cool looking 
like hieroglyphic blocks I had them on in there too. So we're gonna have to find an alternative to that, um, which will be it's kind of it's kind of a bummer, but it'll work. It'll do its job. So let's see here. How many pulverizers do we got? We got these many. All right. So one, two, three. We're gonna we're gonna need a bigger boat. That's for sure. Oh, hello. Okay. So let's go ahead and get some pulverizers going. Can we make any of these? We need copper gears. And it, for some reason, these take a while to craft. Now, I don't understand what's going on. I'm a little salty about it, but not, not that salty. Perfect. Now I'll take a bit. But for like like big crafting, for some reason, just it doesn't want to be nice. Okay, perfect. All right. So we are going to have... My good, my very goodness, much fun times. So I, I love to have item ducks going to all of these, the opaque ones. Um, but we're going to see what we can do. We're going to see what we can do now. Um, we'll probably export out the bottom via, like we'll put the power cables and then uh, the ender IO conduits down at the bottom, but then we'll have the cool like item ducks up top because item ducks It's just cool seeing the items go by Okay, perfect. So let's see here Let's grab Hmm are we out of hardened glass I guess we are It's okay, we'll have to change it later. Huh, travel, item travel, wow, huh, interesting. Oh, don't know what that did. Okay, so the items go into there. We'll have them come in through the back. Um, and then so let's just go like this across the back for now. Okay, just like that. Boom. Okay, so those will all get them. And then... Ah, oh, we're short by one pulverizer. Are we really? Ah, oh, that just makes me so salty. We're missing a piston. That's easy. All right. So now each of these will have to get that done. Okay, so perfect. Uh, that's exactly how I wanted it to look. So now we will be able to just massively smelt items down and all that. I'm going to go ahead and make some hardened glass, you know, because I, I want to do this all like the right way. So I'll knock this all out and be right back. All right. So I got them all looking pretty good here, guys. They look freaking awesome. Now, for those of you with good eyesight, you realize something that I've done. Now, I've actually poked it through the back, but can you see how hard it is to see where it is? Now, you should be able to see it pretty good now because it goes out the back here. But like over here, guys, it looks freaking awesome. We'll end up changing the floor or something like that, making it look better. Uh, but look at that. This just looks awesome. We'll put filters on all of these to make sure that, uh, like, say, iron goes into these two only. And then copper goes into these two. And then, it's like, silver. So we'll probably end up doing something like that. Um, but that's going to be that for uh, the, pros uh, the pulverizers. Uh, over here, we'll do, like, furnaces. We'll do a few more. Or we might even put them on top here. So we'll like either put them like on this block, but just like a row um, or something like that. I don't know yet. It's looking pretty, pretty fancy, though. I do like it a lot. And we're going to leave it like that so you can see all the items flowing through. But I think that's going to go ahead and wrap up the episode for today, guys. I am running low on time as it is. And I'm trying to keep it short so you for, so you guys don't get bored. Uh, but if you guys did like the episode, please do make sure to hit the like button. And don't forget to subscribe. And also make sure to check out the stuff down in the comments 
or the uh, description because I do have my Discord server there and I, it'd be cool to see you guys in the chat because I am there quite a bit looking around, seeing what you guys are doing. But anyways, guys, have I hopefully hopefully you have a great day. I will see you later. Peace out. Bye-bye.